Hey guys, it's uh, me, Lego Boy Fan, coming at you with another Brick Mania review on the Willys Jeep. It's designed by Daniel Siskin. It contains 151 Lego pieces, and you get one Brick Arms weapon, and uh, you get one figure. And I know what you're looking at is five figures, but the four other figures that are on the Jeep itself right now are um, for display only. You can buy them separately. If you want to on brickarms.com for $15 each but uh, you only get the one which is right here you only get that one those are brick arms um, brick arms figures so it's a US infantry soldier uh, it's got the Naboo starfighter um, torso and you got kind of a grin look and it's the old hand face with a Brick Arms M1 pot helmet. Once again, you can buy that on BrickArms.com for $1.25. Nice figure. It's always good to uh, add to your World War II collection. And uh, let's get on to the Jeep. The Jeep itself is $60, and I know that sounds pretty expensive for the size of it. And the reason why it was so expensive is because there's a lot of custom pieces that you can rarely find and it's in the old dark gray color back uh, before 2004 when they introduced the new color. Um, it was a darker, kind of a darkish gray. Now it's a lighter gray. You can tell the difference if you've built like Legos before and you're using gray. Sometimes in your old collection you'll have old dark grays and you'll see a difference between the grays. So when you find these kind of pieces, um, you can only get them on really brick link. You can't get them on pick a brick, so uh, that's why the cost is a lot higher. And um, there is some unique building on it. Um, it's uh, I think probably about 10 inches, maybe, maybe about seven inches. Um, the size is what it looks like on the actual thing. I'm pretty sure this is 1 to 35 a scale of the real thing. And um, yep, like I said, these figures that are in it right now are Brick Arms figures that have printed torsos. Um, but you can get them on BrickArms.com if you want. You get one Brick Arms uh, in one grand and you can stick it in here inside like that. And then you also get one backpack for the uh, soldier if you want, but you're really supposed to put it on the Jeep. Right there, really, wherever you really want. But, um, that's what it looks like with the fully loaded Jeep. Let's go ahead and take the figures out. Okay, so I took out the figures, and I put in the figure you actually get with the kit. And, uh, I guess we don't really need this, so I'll take that out. And, um... Yep. So that's what it looks like with the one figure you get. Those four other figures, like I said, you can buy separately if you want to on uh, BrickArms.com. And um, the two features that you get with it is, first of all, like the real Jeep, the uh, window can go down. Just like that. And, um, dang it, why does that backpack always fall off? You know what? I'm just going to keep it at this side. It really doesn't matter. Um, you get a um, machine gun, which is uh, nice, I will say. Everybody loves a machine gun, as I say. <laughs> and then you get this, uh, I think it's a gas tank on the back. I'm not totally sure. I'm pretty sure that's a gas tank it comes with. And then you get uh, a spare tire, which goes on the back, as you can see. Um, yep, so pretty nice, I will say. You get two shovels. But uh, they're supposed to be part of the kit. You don't really use the shovels, like, actually. But um, I think that's when, because this one, I think the Willys Jeep wasn't a total off-road um, Jeep because I was told it sometimes got stuck in the mud. I think that's what the shovels are for. I'm not totally sure on that. The mirror design is pretty cool. I will say, uh, nice design in there, Dan. Go ahead and get a little stud as a mirror. It's a pretty unique idea. You get a little backrest. Um, you can fit four figures like I showed you earlier in the video. And, uh, yep. 
You get, uh, it's only two pages of instructions, front and back. It's in color. So, that's nice. Um, the box looks like this. It's actually a pretty big box. Uh, for a little Jeep, but then again. It's number 210 out of 220 made. It's signed by Dan. And it's, uh, like I said earlier, the model number is uh, 224. Um, quality guaranteed means like if he forgets a piece or anything then uh, he'll ship it immediately but uh, like the panther tank I showed earlier uh, let's see here it opens like that nice little box it's a collector box so um yep like I said I guess that's pretty much it um so, uh, there you have it, the Willys Jeep. Next Brickmania review will be the 2010 Battle Pack, which comes with three uh, Brickmania sets. That'll be coming sometime next week whenever uh, it ships, because I had to pre-order it. And uh, sadly, that'll be the last Brickmania review until like maybe the end of summer when I go to Brick Fair. So, keep an eye out for um, more Brickmania reviews, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed this review. And uh, see you guys later. It's been uh, Lego Boy Fan, and catch you guys later. Bye.